as you can see by the title, I have chosen violence today. Let's go. What is going on people's DJ Av here. If you are a first time viewer of this channel, I highly recommend subscribing. It helps out this channel so much when you guys subscribe and hit the like button. A lot of you guys have been leaving messages in my DMs, leaving messages in my email, leaving messages in my comment section about my opinions on Drum Monkey. Well, I'm about to tell you why reasons why you should not purchase this plugin and the main reason why is unison audio is a type of company that likes to control the content that is on youtube so they copyright strike content creators like me that do reviews and give honest opinions pros and cons on products and if it doesn't meet their criteria they try to silence you now a company if that all that offers a guarantee a 60 day guarantee why would they do that why do they want to silence the criticism hmm i wonder why is it because the product isn't a good product or is it because they want as much money as humanly possible well let me prove why and i'll show you and i definitely want to hear from you guys how you feel about unison audio i think i already know the answer to that let's go so the first super red flag is this right here. There's no demo version available. Now, a company that wants you to spend $300, they want $300 for Drum Monkey, but there is no demo version for you guys to try before you put in $300. Screw the money back guarantee. Screw the fact that there are there's a payment system. There's no demo version. What company other than a company that has something to hide would not have a demo version available. Let me know and I'll show you different. So again, uh, this right here is XO. There's a trial version for you to try before you buy. Uh, Drum Computer, another Estelier plugin that costs less, $119, has a demo version. Playbeat, which is another phenomenal plugin, way less in price, trial version and it has all of the same freaking features as drum monkey if not better something is rotten in denmark and then atlas there is a free trial version and it costs less so you're gonna tell me that unison audio doesn't have confidence in their own product to at least allow you to have a demo version for you to try hmm. something's wrong guys and then there's captain Beat right here, which is another plugin that is a part of a hundred dollar bundle. A hundred dollar bundle with all this stuff right here, and there is a trial version of that too. Unison Audio, the scams is over with, guys. It is not on my watch, not on my freaking watch, bro. So here we are. Here's the website. I'm not gonna link it in the description box because there's plenty of damn influencers that are trying to push this product to you. But this is a major red flag right here. 60 day money back guarantee. That is a lie. I, I have so many people that DM me daily to this very day since my first video that got copyright striked by them that they haven't got their money back because they was dissatisfied about their MIDI pack. Their MIDI pack when they was trying to sell you a C minor, something that's already in your DAW. Drug the media and then. Ah. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. You have built-in scales in every doll. I say that every time. Then they have a payment plan. Why would you need a payment plan for a plugin that is actually probably worth $10 at best? It should be, they should charge a, a bare minimal on a realistic scale, 50 bucks for this MIDI randomizer plugin. That's all it is. And then the biggest red flag right here, another one, uh, only 3,500 licenses. So they're trying to push this limited time only type deal here. And I wanna, let, let's bust out a calculator, shall we? Let's bust out a calculator. So if they're offering 3,500 licenses and they're charging $300. So 3,500 times 300 equals $1 million. So <laughs> that's the real plan is them to make a million dollars as fast as humanly possible 
This is disgusting. And this is just for hip hop. guys know I, and and to show you in comparison let's go ahead and just scroll down here look at how much they try to sell you on this phenomenal plugin it a very good plugin doesn't need this much selling like it's so much selling on this website I'm still scrolling down they have all this stuff over here and there let me show you in comparison to a company that offers you get a better deal <laughs> and let's scroll down this is mixed in key and, and trust me guys, when I say this, they took the idea for mixed in key. Is there something wrong with that offering and competition? No, I, I highly recommend competition. Competition makes everybody better at the end of the day, right? But dude, let me show you. Captain Plugins. Captain Plugins. Hmm. This plugin has existed for quite a while and it does the exact same thing and has twice as much or if not 10 times the amount of content and the price point of this is freaking what let's see it a hundred dollars and you get a whole bunch i have a whole video on that so i'll show you that in a little bit but do i use it a lot no i don't i'm just gonna be real i don't use it a lot but i'll show you something i do use though drum computer I know you guys need the inside scoop on that. I have a whole video on that, but I'll just show you right here in FL Studio. No cap. I don't even make beats in FL Studio, and yet I had a better beat than most of the demos for Drum Monkey using those two plugins which have real machine learning. Bruh, you guys are getting screwed. I'm just saying. So let's look at the content creators that have done reviews for Drum Monkey. And this is where things just really get sour for me because I seen one person do it. Well, the first person that pops up is Bolo. Bolo, <laughs> and <laughs> wow. And yeah, I think Bolo is a talented uh, content creator, talented music producer, and he offers a lot to this community at the end of the day. But sometimes, man, uh, you gotta be responsible enough to say, hey, I, I don't need your money. I don't need your money, Unison Audio. You, you, you are known for attacking people or whatever. And I, I can't say uh, straight up that Bolo is one of the evil people, nor do, am I advocating uh, for you guys to unsubscribe or not to watch his content. I think his content is very good. Uh, and he get, he got caught up in a situation called Drum Monkey and it's, it's just ridiculous. And, and one thing I like to say about Bolo is this right here. This man has constantly came at the necks of Akai about their products in which they listen to it because a good company likes to improve on their product, right? Well, I don't recall Akai giving him a copyright strike for his videos, but hmm, Unison Audio definitely copyright striked and took down my videos, but yet he's co-signing that company. Bolo, can we do better now? Can we, can we do better? That's all I'm asking. And as I can see, uh, at 90% likes, there are a whole bunch of dislikes. And I don't know this guy, uh, but I'm pretty sure he's a very talented content creator. Uh, I don't want to not. Very Sick Beats did a video on this. Man, this is very hard for me to see. Uh, Sweet Scale TV, I expect him to do stuff like that. But this one right here really hurt me right here, which is Tatro. And there's a comment that I want to read on this video too. Now, one thing I will point out is that Tatro uh, put in includes pay promotion. So he's being honest with you guys. Transparency. And, and I love this dude. This is my homie, man. He's a very talented content creator and I don't want to knock him for what it is. So I'm choosing this uh, comment right here by a guy named F. I can, I don't know how to pronounce his name. I do apologize uh, for mispronouncing it. It says $300 for essentially a MIDI pack with dice. 
for that, there's a lot of cool stuff out there like Superior Drummer. And yes, yeah, Superior Drummer is an amazing product, guys. If you wanna have like real life rock drums and, and so forth, I also uh, recommend Easy Drummer too, and uh, which is by, I forgot, Tune Track. I've done a review on their products before. Uh, it is better value for the money. Heck, you can get your pro version of the various dolls for that. There, yes, there's DAWs. Uh, FL Studio, by the way, actually allows you to roll dice and they will do drum lines for you too as well. I don't think a lot of people know that. But hey, guess what? That's what I'm here for. And this comment right here that I'm about to read by Liz Kurt, uh, this sums up my feelings for this video and for content creators that choose to do this influencer thing uh, no matter what. And I know guys, the mo money is good. Uh, greed is good. That's what they say. But at the same time, you have to have a conscious to understand when a company is has an agenda. And that's what Unison Audio does. Is they have an agenda. They're not trying to make a really good product. Otherwise, they wouldn't censor channels like mine. Uh, it says, I'm a big fan of your channel, one of the best out there for production tips, and love your music theory lessons. I have to say, I was surprised to see this on your channel. I've been plagued by viral advertising from Unison. Uh, first, the Unison MIDI chord pack, uh, now Beat Monkey. It seems to be overpriced at and the $3,500 license thing is another aggressive market strategy. Think about that, guys. This is horrible the way that they're doing this. Drum Monkey appearance looks like it was designed by a child <laughs> after playing Donkey Kong. <laughs> Not that $300 plus VST, and for that price, you could buy Addictive Drums too. And, or even a full DAW. Logic is only uh, $200. The beat you made for in Drunk Monkey doesn't sound anywhere as good as the beats you play live. Oh, oh I'm sorry, Tatro, but it's the truth, man. Tatro, I love you, dude. Uh, all my content creators, we gotta do better uh, when it comes to uh, who we work with. I know sponsored videos are a thing and YouTube doesn't pay enough. They already take 40% of advertising. Hell, they take 40% for donations. Donations. They want everything. So I know the conscious decision to, uh, to use uh, money to get sponsorships and then t there's companies that offer a lot of money, but obviously uh, your audience is seeing through the BS and yeah, man. Tatro, I love you, my dude, but we have to do better as content creators, man. You inspire me. And that's the thing I want to say about uh, Tatro. He inspires me to do better with my content creation. And that's something that I want to say. And I don't want to be a bully and tell people uh, to hate on him or, or any of these content creators' videos. Let's be, I want to be real about that. So tell me how you feel about this video. I definitely want to get to you guys and talk about my pros and cons. Again, this isn't necessarily a review video. I just wanted to point out some of the scam-tacular things that Unison Audio does, and these tactics are disrespectful. I mean, the main point that I wanted to drive down on is there's no demo version for you to try out before purchasing it. The second red flag is this a $300 3,500 limited license, which again, adds up to a million dollars. If they sell all 3,500 of their licenses or their limited licenses, they make a million dollars. Think about that, which ultimately brings me to another point here. Why is it that Unison Audio likes to like, oh my God, oh, I just can't stand this company. Oh my God, freaking trash. The plugin is trash. 